Hey, what's good you guys? Breezy here today brings a brand new video. In today's video, we're gonna be talking all about mods. Now I know in the past I said I don't wanna use any mods in my game because I wanna do a vanilla game because for people who actually wanna get into The Sims who've never seen it before, I kinda wanna keep it vanilla due to the sheer fact that you can't do everything in game. So if I keep it vanilla, then you will be able to see everything that you can do in game. But honestly, it's boring. I cannot even lie to you guys, the game is so boring. Maybe it's just me, but I actually ended up downloading some mods. So before I came out with the new episode of my Game of Life Let's Play, I decided let me hop on here and tell you guys about the mods that I currently downloaded for my game. So let's get started with the, f the first one, the basic one. As everyone knows, MC Command Center. Everybody knows what that is, so I'm not even gonna go into it. If you guys need to know more information, YouTube is this everywhere. Everyone talks about MC Command Center. You got it, all right? So now the next one is Woohoo Wellness and Pregnancy Overhaul. So it's basically like a woohoo, like it's basically all about pregnancy and everything. So teen pregnancies can happen, some other stuff that's like, I don't even know if I can say that on YouTube, but you know, like diseases and if you don't want a baby no more, you don't got to have a baby no more. And I do mean adoption and the other thing. Take that how you will. But yeah, basically it adds more relationship between two Sims. If they want to have a baby, if they don't want to have a baby, if it's an unexpected pregnancy, they can tell their partner. If it's a teen pregnancy, then they can go tell their mom and it has different interactions like that. The real reason why I wanted to get mods in the first place is I wanted a banking mod, an SB, oh, S in bank mod. So I downloaded this mod because I wanted my Sims to have separate bank accounts. I didn't want it there. I didn't want his money from his job going straight into his, into the household funds because then one, I would have to keep track of how much he's earning. I would probably never realize how much um, money he actually has. If I say, let's move out of the house or whatever. I just wanted something that was already automatically doing it and completely separated from the household inventory. So that's why I downloaded this mod and I already went through and I added the bank and everything into the lot. So I hopefully it works. I have not even tested it out yet, but we'll see. Then I went on ahead and got life's drama mod. So there is actually a lot of stuff that I actually, reason why I got this, because one, it's that the burglars are back. As you guys know, I'm an advent for bring back burglars to the Sims 4. You already know, I say that every time. They also have like where bad things can happen around some Sims or some crazy life events could happen. So you could see a bride running down the street away so she doesn't want to get married. You can see people getting proposed to in the middle of the street. You can see Sims giving birth or anything that's just crazy that you could expect to see in real life anywhere you go. You never know, you know? Does that make sense? So that's why I got this because it's like all drama. And the final mod that I downloaded was the Slice of Life base mod. I think that's what it's called. Let me just double, triple check. Yeah, just the base of Slice of Life. I didn't download any packs that it looks like it comes with. So basically the reason why I downloaded the Slice of Life mod is because it kind of does like teens in a sense where they'll get pimples on their face. They're gonna go through like life like we did. And I wanted something more realistic to my game to have more of that drama feel. So that's why I added this thing. There's also a lot of stuff that I don't know about each and every mod, what it does. I didn't really look too deep into each mod. I just saw some things that I really wanted for myself and I downloaded them. So so yeah, I only added a total of five mods to my game. Just to let you guys know, links for everything will be down in the description below. So these mods are gonna be a part of my Game of Life Let's Play series come, that's been out on my channel. And instead of just me starting up the series with these mods, I decided to let me make a quick video about it before. So if you guys are interested in seeing that Let's Play, I will have the playlist linked down below or in the card above. And let me know what you guys think. Should I add any more mods? Are there any more mods that'll give my gameplay more realistic feeling? Let me know, let me know. And I will see you guys in my next video. Peace out everybody.